Hello friends and welcome to Un Café Bilingual, please. Today we are going to talk about six idioms about numbers. So let's start. The first one is a million miles away. What do you think that it could mean? What is the meaning of that? A million miles away. ¿Qué puede significar a million miles away? The meaning of that is to be distracted. Es estar distraído. Let's see an example of that. Mark, what's going on? You are a million miles away. Entonces, aquí lo que vemos es Mark... ¿Qué sucede? Estás distraído. You are a million miles away. Ok, in the number two position, we have the following idiomatic expression. Kill two birds with one stone. Es muy similar a la expresión en español. Entonces, kill two birds with one stone. In English, we say matar dos pájaros con una piedra. In Spanish, we have a different way to say it. And the meaning of that is to achieve two goals with one action. To achieve two goals with one action. Lograr dos objetivos con una acción. For example, in this case, We have, I killed two birds with one stone, my graduation and my perfect job. En este caso, él mató dos pájaros con un solo tiro, como diríamos en español. En inglés, I killed two birds with one stone. ¿Por qué? Porque se graduó y al graduarse obtiene su trabajo perfecto. So he killed two birds with one stone. In the position number three, we have as easy as one, two, three. As easy as one, two, three. ¿Qué puede significar tan fácil como uno, dos y tres? Traducción literal. Entonces, vamos a ver el significado. The meaning of it is something simple as counting one, two, three. Something simple as counting one, two, three. Entonces, en este caso es tan fácil como contar uno, dos o tres, ¿sí? En, a veces decimos piece of cake, como pan comido. <laughs> Those are expressions to mean something simple. In this case, we have an example. Is dancing difficult for you? Mmm, it's as easy as counting one, two, three. Aquí alguien está preguntando, is dancing difficult for you? Y la persona contesta, mm, it's as easy as counting one, two, three. In the position number four, we have 50-50. What does 50-50 mean? Yes, the meaning of that is something divided equally. It could be, for example, when we go to a restaurant with some friends and, they, and we say, let's pay 50-50. Yes, in this case, it's one, with one friend. Uh, or uh, let's do this 50-50. We divide the responsibility 50-50. Number five, take five. What is the meaning of that? What do you think it is? The meaning is to take a five minutes break or a short pause. For example, you have been working hard or you have been studying hard and maybe the teacher or your boss will say something like this. We've been working hard. Please take five. So you can relax five minutes or to make a short pause. Number six, six feet under. What do you think that is the meaning of that? The meaning is dead and buried. For example, 
This is the case of two friends talking about Robin Williams. One of them says, Robin Williams is a great actor. And the other one replies, yes, he was. He is six feet under. It implies that the person is deaf. Esta expresión prácticamente lo que dice es que está muerto y enterrado. Hace alusión a los entierros que se hacían anteriormente que eran seis pies bajo tierra. We hope that you have enjoyed this idiomatic expression as much as we did. And remember to subscribe to our channel Un Café Bilingual, please.